All right, so I'll be showing you how to download the PyCharm for this very course and how you can be able to install it. So for me, I already have PyCharm downloaded into my laptop. So but I'll just show you how to download yours. So firstly, you just come, you go to jetbrains.com and then um, slash PyCharm. So once or you can, another way you can do it is you just say, Download PyCharm, for instance. Download PyCharm. Then you click to install. Then you click on JetBrains. Then, so this professional is the paid version. Well, the PyCharm Community Edition, that is the one we'll be using. So this is not a paid version. This one is an open source and you will not need to pay any money. So you just click on download. So once you are done downloading, um, it's going to come to down your downloader or wherever you put it, but here is mine. So after you click, you're done downloading, then you right click on it, just like the way you install your normal Microsoft, uh, no, just the way you install your packages. So you click on yes. So the current version of version is already installed. So do you wish to install? No, because I already installed it. So how you can install it is for you to continually say yes, yes, yes to all the conditions that it's going to be asking you and then it will be installed automatically. So once you are done installing how to uh, launch it, you just come and type PyCharm. So PyCharm, so this is the app for you to launch. Then you click on the app. And once the app, uh, my app is opening, so I've already opened some applications, but you can just, once your app opened, then you can come to file, then you click on new project so that you can be able to type. Um, so you can just say, um, here, the name of the project is my first, my, my first Python project. Python code, whatever you want to use, whatever you want to use. So I'll just say click create. So I want it to be on a new window. Yippee, and then you have it here. So right now you have successfully installed your PyCharm. Please do ensure you reach out if you are lost and you don't know how to install your PyCharm. Thank you. See you in the next lecture.